walking in the food. Hey, 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 what's going on all? What's going on? So, I always get people on my YouTube channel quite often, you know, messaging people saying, Oh, hey, Justin, I, uh, I'm a woodworker, or I'm an aluminum guy, or I'm a fiberglass guy, and you ever need any work done, just give me a call. But they're always in another province, another city, or even in the U.S. So here's a call. This is a call for anyone here, locally, on the BC South Coast, uh, Metro Vancouver area, or on Vancouver Island, or somewhere nearby. If you live here and you're an expert in fiberglass, I'd like to talk to you. I have plans for the roof. As I've been saying for a long time now, I want to get my railing done, my permanent railing up there. However, since Manfred threw that boat on my roof <laughs> before he left for Germany, um, it's kind of uh, put it on hold now until I decide what I'm going to do, whether I'm going to build the uh, railing to uh, accommodate a boat as well, you know, that sort of thing. Anyways, but that's not what I'm talking about. Oh, God, I really need to clean the roof. Look at that. It's getting dirty. I'm going to have to... I usually drive this through a pressure washer um, every two weeks or so, and it looks like it's time to do it because there's a nice layer of dust up on the roof. Anyhow... I want to build on this side, the driver's side of the van, a fiberglass extension on the roof. Okay, it's going to come up right about there. See where the, where the roof comes down there, right there? I want it to start right about there at about the angle of the roof vent cover. I want it to go up to about there, about the height of the TV antenna. Okay, so it's gonna come up on an angle and then go straight across and then it's gonna come down on a slope to match the back slope right there. Okay, so a box. Now it's not going to be the full width of the van. What I want is something that will come out to uh, right about there. So it'll be about yay wide. Like I'll get all the measurements obviously and then we'll build a box. So it'll just, it'll be like the roof continues up right there and then goes straight across to the front and then back down again. And it will be a fiberglass storage box. I already have a door, an RV door, and it's already wrapped in the same purple as well, which I can drill a hole in the box and install the door so I can access it from the inside. But it will also serve as a seat. Okay, so I'll put a couple of boat seats, or maybe just one boat seat up on the roof, uh, uh, like a flip-up seat on top of that box. But on the slope, on the front, and on the back, I'll put two more of these little panels. So another, an extra 60 watts or so. So I'll have a panel on an angle like that, and a panel on an angle like that, and then literally I'll have all angles covered on this van for solar panels. So a fiberglass box, which of course when it's done, it'd be nice if it was, it could be bolted down to the roof or even uh, joined right to the existing fiberglass roof, uh, but I will have it wrapped in the matching purple so it'll look like it was part of the van, it'll look factory. You see what I'm saying? And then on the other side of the van is where the railing will will come out so the box will be you know probably as high as that boat is and it'll come to about here and then from there I'll attach a railing right there and it'll come all the way around and then along to the front on this side so this side will be a railing the other side will be a large box slash bench seat slash solar panel mounting device <laughs> so if anyone around vancouver metro vancouver is uh, good with fiberglass uh, or has a shop or has any hookups or can at least point me in the right direction i mean i'd rather put it out on on youtube before i go to a shop a marine shop that does fiberglass work and then after the fact i get all these messages on my channel saying well i could have done that for you justin yeah man like like seriously i'd rather support one of my viewers locally if I can and uh, so uh, we'll work something out and of course I'll, I'll pay you a fair price whatever you think it's worth for your time and and your skills and we'll get this done and then once I get that box up I can finish the railing on the other side I'm not gonna worry about the boat for now I, once it's done maybe I'll just throw the boat up top but I might actually I have a place where I can store the boat so if I want to use it in the summertime I'll use it so I'm not planning to leave the boat up there all year round so I just want to build this box and uh, and then build the and get the railing done. I already have a place here in Vancouver that's going to do the railing for me, so I just need the box done first, and then we'll do the railing. So, hey, hey, if that's you, send me a message. 
uh, go to my website. The link is right below in the description, justincredible.tv. Go click on the contact tab and there's a form there. Uh, just fill out your name and your email address. Send me a message. I will get back to you as soon as I can. If not, I'll go to a shop. But there's no huge rush to get this done. Um, it is November, so... Uh, I mean, I'm not, I'm not going to be on my roof so much until probably springtime, so I'd like to get it done. I mean, the faster I put this out here, the more likely it is uh, we'll get the ball rolling on this. You see what I'm saying? So cool. So yeah, um, sorry, I'm not going to do the second floor. Everyone's asking me if I'm going to do a double decker on this. No, we're not going to go that high. Okay. <laughs> I can go up quite a bit higher before it becomes an issue. I mean, this is still, uh, this is still a lot lower than a lot of truck campers and, and bigger RVs. So there's a lot of room I can play with up there, but I'd like to have a grab railing on this side, just like a boat, just a little grab railing. So you lean down and grab it if you have to, but also to secure things too, like my skis or whatever else I need to put up on the roof. And then again, on the other side will be a box, which will also be patio seating. So I know you can buy prefab stuff like uh, aluminum truck, uh, checker plate truck boxes and even uh, boat uh, bench seats. But I'd rather have something custom built to the, uh, the dimensions and the angles uh, for this van to make it all look great. Keep on rocking and rolling in the free world, everyone. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you want to check me out on my social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, maybe buy some rad t-shirts like this, or maybe you want to show me your rig or ask me some questions, just head on over to justincredible.tv. Why don't you uh, get a job, you homeless uh, bum? Get a job? Yeah. What? Excuse me? What's the matter with you, you white picket fence loving idiot? Why don't you go give your landlord some money and pay for the privilege of living in his house? Now who's homeless now, huh? Just Incredible TV is not gluten-free.